Hello. Welcome to my life. Um, I am just leaving work. It's Tuesday, August 1st. It's August 1st. Wow. <laughs> I have to get gas desperately. And then there is a new used bookstore um, downtown. And hold on, gotta go fast. I made it. There is a new used bookstore downtown. And I wanted to go there when I didn't work yesterday, but they were, they're closed on Mondays. So now that it is Tuesday, I would like to go to the used bookstore and see what they have. So before I go home and completely pass out and nap, I'm going to do that. I'm gonna to go to the used bookstore. Oh my gosh, you guys. My day just got 100% better. I was not having the best day, but my day just got so much better. So I posted on my TikTok, my um, to be read list for August is finishing A Court of Silver Flames. Then I wanted to read Fourth Wing. Then I wanted to read the two Crescent City books. And Fourth Wing was out of stock in literally every store that it could be in stock in in my town. That used bookstore that I just went to, I thought was just a used bookstore. No, it's a new and used bookstore. And they had like six of these right in the window. And I didn't even know, like I'd never been there before. So um, I didn't even look around. I snatched this up so fast. It was $10 more than I wanted to spend, but I do not even care because I have been looking for this. And now when I finish Silver Flames, I can jump right into Fourth Wing. I was gonna have to order it on Amazon and I wasn't gonna be able to read it right away, but I'm so excited. So I got my copy of Fourth Wing it's going to sit on my bookshelf next to Akatar for right now while I finish A Court of Silver Flames. And then that is my next book that I will be reading. But that just made my whole day. I'm so excited. And I signed up for like a, uh, like a loyalty. I don't know if you get like points or your frequent buyer or whatever they called it, but I signed up for their program because I'm definitely gonna go back because of that, right? Like they just, I told the lady, I was like, you're the only store in town that has this book in stock. And she was like, yeah, I know. I'm so excited. I'm getting out half an hour early, 20 minutes early, early, but I'm out. So that's cool. <laughs> it was kind of slow today, but people were tipping a lot. Like I made $11 in tips today and I usually average like four or five. So that's cool. Oh, getting more tips today was cool. I'm going to CVS right now to grab one of my prescriptions and then I'm going home and I don't know, I don't have anything else really going on today, but I do have to go in for blood work tomorrow morning and I am just like notoriously dehydrated all the time. So I need to make sure that I am drinking water this afternoon and tonight so that tomorrow morning when they go to draw my blood, it's not like impossible because it's usually impossible.
done uploading my YouTube video. I was literally falling asleep while it was uploading. But it's uploaded for tomorrow. Now it's time for me to take a nap. I've earned my nap. It's my turn. Good night. Good morning. Happy Thursday. It's early, it's like 8, 15, I don't know. But I'm up early drinking water because I have to go get blood work done. I had a doctor's appointment on Monday, just like my yearly one. And I just have to go get like routine blood work done. But I have really small veins and I'm chronically dehydrated all the time. So I'm drinking water so that they hopefully don't have to poke me more than twice. They usually have to poke me like 17 times and I wish I was exaggerating, but I'm not. So hopefully not too many pokes this morning. Cause that's just gonna put me in a bad mood. But yeah, I'm rocking a pajama look to go to the doctor. And then I'm probably gonna go get coffee and then come home and I do work at noon. So see what we can get done in that time frame. Yay, I'm done. They got me in only one poke. Amazing. I feel like drinking the water definitely helped, but also, like, I told her this time, like, because I've heard from other nurses and phlebotomists that um, going in your hands is painful, and so they will try to go in, in your arms um, as much as they can before they go in your hands, but I have bigger veins in my hands and my wrists, so I kind of told her, I was like, I was like, I would rather have you go in a more painful spot than poke me a bunch of times. So if you just feel like you want to go in my hand first, just do it. And so she like looked at my arms and then she looked at both my hands and she was like, yeah, I think this one will work. And I was like, okay, cool. She was like, it is going to bruise and like hurt a little more. And I was like, I don't care. Like, it's fine. I'd rather be one and done or two and done than seven or eight and done. So one and done so impressed i love it okay i did take a bath and i did get coffee earlier um this is just chocolate cold brew we went simple today i really need to get dressed for work i'm having the worst cramps so that's fun but a couple of vlogs ago i talked about how i couldn't find a deodorant that was working for me and i felt stinky all the time so just wanted to report back that this dove deodorant spray has been working for me and I just got coconut scent but it's been working pretty well so if you have a problem with deodorant working for you I suggest this I'm home now from work oh look at Bobby right now <laughs> um I am grumpy as hell my cramps are really bad and I had Joe make me rice last night so that I could make myself dinner tonight because he has a camp out, so I'm alone, But and I hate using a rice maker. But I just um, rage ordered McDonald's because my period just wants me to eat greasy food and not healthy food. So I'm gonna do that. And I stripped down to my period underwear shorts and this crop top and I am literally just going to eat McDonald's and read my book. I wanna finish my book tonight, so that's my goal. Finish my book, and that is the only thing I wanna to do tonight. I'm just completely over everything. How do you feel about this? Come here. Show YouTube your blankie. Bring it. I'm laying on it so he can't get it. So, Bobby and I are gonna hang out. We're having a Bobby mommy night. And literally, all I'm gonna do is read my book. So, if I don't vlog anything else, just know I read my book. If I do vlog more, it's probably just gonna be me reading my book. So, really interesting. Yep. <laughs> this is normal life. <laughs>